y'all. Oh, I don't know if I like recording. So, I booked myself for a facial and a massage this weekend. I just don't even know. Like, I don't even know. That felt so good. Like, so freaking good. So, yeah, um, the facials in the morning, and then, yeah, I'll see y'all guys in the morning. So, like I said, today I have a facial. It is currently 9.23 a.m., and I am here luckily it was only like 10 minutes away from my house so that was good so yeah um yeah okay let's go And then you say that your skin type is normal to combination, so I'm staying, so it looks like it's more on the normal to oily. Mm -hmm. And will you say that you're oily all over or only in your T zone areas? Probably just the T zone area. T zone area, mm -hmm. okay. <clears throat> and then we just talked about the male acne. And then, so your current skincare products is black soap and coconut oil. Mm -hmm. Okay, and how are you liking those products? They're pretty good. Okay. Yeah. And now, some oil. of my areas, maybe like. Up in here, sometimes those tend to get dry. Okay. But yeah, it's basically up in here and then like in my gotcha. forehead area, they get oily. Okay. And then typically your cheeks area is a little bit thinner. Mm -hmm. So you might feel the products penetrate a little bit deeper on mm -hmm. your cheeks versus anywhere else on your face okay. as well. And then your nose has the most largest oil glands on your face. Mm -hmm. So everybody typically knows it's oily. Okay. And then sometimes <clears throat> some people know it's oilier than most. Okay. Um, and then... You're not on any acne medication. Mm -hmm. um, and then exfoliation, since you don't have any exfoliation either between the two of these, the difference is one is more tailored to anti-aging, which is this one, mm -hmm. and it has lightening benefits. It helps with hyperpigmentation, so it has cojea and malic acid mm -hmm. in it. This one doesn't have any brightening as well as no anti-aging. So, that's the difference between the two. Mm -hmm. um, then, I would recommend a toner that I don't have <laughs> and some moisturizer. Um, but, if you were interested in trying a product, I do have um, sample products uh -huh. um, where you can get three samples for $10. Okay. And then, um, you'll be able to get a cleanser, a exfoliation, and a moisturizer. So, you can at least try out the product. To and see if how, you end up yeah. liking it, you can definitely always come back here and get your products at your next appointment or um, order them directly online as okay. well. Okay, that's, that's mm -hmm. I am living... Wax fix and sell ring lights as well. Yeah. Portable high frequencies, um, equipment, mm -hmm. mirrors. Yes, say hey to the people. Hi, people. Tell My them name who you is are. Ebony. I am with Serving Faces Spa as well as Serving Faces Professional Store. Located here in Charlotte, North Carolina. I am um, a pimple popper enthusiastic and I really, really love um, pimple popping as well as teaching people about their skin, how to treat their skin, how to maintain healthy skin, as well as doing corrective skin care. So hopefully you guys come check me out. Yeah. And I got a little, um, little kit, just a little tester, just to see what it's giving. Okay, I need to y'all i am so upset hey y'all it's the same day after the um facial or whatever y'all i'm so upset so i'm on the way to trap wing festival it's that brought me all the way out here to valentine do you understand like apple 
I don't know what y'all got going on with this GPS, but baby, this ain't it. This is not it at all, okay? Like, like, I'm about to be already an hour and some change late. Hour and a half late. Like, bro, like, I'm gonna relax. I'm gonna keep calm. I'm gonna be okay. So I'll see you guys when I finally get there at 3.05. Like, bro, I'm tight. Y'all, I finally made it. Oh my God. Festival. <laughs> LA next. Me and Charlotte now. That was sold out date. 14 dates already. All sold out. That's, That's it. it. We got to come to Atlanta. I didn't end out the vlog yesterday, but yes, Trap Wing Festival was a vibe. I told the guy, I was like, well, you heard it in like the last clip. I said, yeah, I said, we definitely got to come check him out when he's uh, back in his hometown of Atlanta. Uh, so yeah, the next one, he said, it's due to be a surprise. Um, I ain't gonna spill the beans, but it's gonna be a good surprise if it works out how it's supposed to work out. So yeah, um, thank you guys for watching. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you all in the next video. Bye!